Hello, me again. It's John Conley with Pro Tools Services and another Pro Tools Top 10 Keyboard Shortcut that everyone should know. In this video, we'll cover just a few of the shortcuts in the Commands Keyboard Focus Mode. These are the shortcuts displayed on the optional Pro Tools Keyboard. In this video, we're going to focus on these shortcuts. First of all, make sure Commands Focus is enabled here by clicking on the A to Z button to the left of the clips list in your Pro Tools edit window. Yellow is enabled. Here we go. The E key, technically called Zoom Toggle, but most often referred to as the Expand or Enlarge key, is a huge time saver. Make a selection on the Pro Tools timeline, hit the E key, and that selection is expanded in track height and zoomed in to fill the screen. This makes editing with the Smart Tool ideal. Hitting the E key again returns to the previous track height and zoom. R equals zoom out. T equals zoom in. A or Trim Clip Start. Use this to trim off any unwanted audio at the beginning of a clip. Hitting A trims the clip up to the cursor location. S, or Trim Clip End. Use this to trim off any unwanted audio at the end of a clip. S trims the end of the clip to the cursor location. D, or Fade In. Creates a fade in from the clip start to the cursor location. F, or crossfade, creates a crossfade the duration of the selection without bringing up the fades window. G, or fade out, creates a fade out from the cursor to the clip end. I hope you find these helpful and check back here for more Pro Tools shortcuts, tips and tricks, and support. Thanks, see you next time.